hello guys i am Loxman. well a warm welcome to all my new subscribers to my channel in this video i'll show you the installation process of jekyll if you don't know what jekyll is please check my previous video i suppose you are using linux or mac os as we will be using command line okay without further delay let's get started in your computer system open the terminal so here's my terminal jekyll is built on top of ruby programming language so to run jekyll we need to have ruby installed at first so uh, to make sure that ruby is installed or not in your computer system just uh, execute this command and it says <coughs> ruby is not installed in my co computer okay let me install ruby first sorry i am using fedora 25 so <coughs> i'm using dnf command and i'm appending dash devil option so that i won't get any more errors in the future if you are using ubuntu you can just uh, make it to dash dev dev or you can just uh, make it only sudo dnf install ruby also so this is the easiest way of installing ruby so type your password if asked it might take some time for downloading the packages have patience and wait for a while Let me tell something about Jekyll until the, the screen downloads. Mm. <coughs> Jekyll is a static blog over site generator that means you can write blogs with Jekyll and uh, it can be freely hosted on GitHub pages so you, do, you don't need to pay anything for hosting and since no databases are involved in Jekyll uh, there is no any chances of being hacked or you don't need to configure database so it's kind of hassle free for you to yeah, it is taking some time in my computer something zekilib.com is the official website of zekil site and it has all the necessary information for you okay so this is how zekil works I am writing box on Zekil. It is taking a lot of time. has been downloaded and it's installing the packages okay so looks like ruby has been installed let me check okay the version of ruby is 2.3.3 so <coughs> we 
have uh, to be installed now let's install jekyll so you can install jekyll easily with gen install jekyll command and mm, i'm on fedora 25 i got some errors doing this so i'll be doing this command so sorry Okay, you can just do them install the kill on your device. Okay, it has downloaded and it has it is installing the packages okay let me check if it has been installed okay the latest version is jekyll 3.3.1 the latest version of jekyll has been installed also we need to install bundler since we will be doing a lot of work installing different kinds of gems so the general command is then install bundler so you can execute this command instead of this i'll use the command like before sorry okay so you can just uh, do both the installation in the simple single step like them install the in bundler this will install both Jekyll and Bolero, okay. So Bolero also has been also installed now. Let's start. Uh, so we have the basic requirements for a Jekyll site. Now let's create a new Jekyll site. So we do with this Jekyll new. So since Jekyll means we are giving new command to Jekyll, new means to make a new site. So new, and you can give any name of your site. I will give my blog, okay. So it is out of the new site has been automatically installed in this location so i am in root directory and it has it the jekyll is running bundle install itself okay so let me show you the uh, files okay so this is the folder jekyll just generated and it has already created all <coughs> basic necessary components for us like it has created a basic website for us in the easiest way okay so to view how the website is we need to uh, start a local server to do this first we need to navigate inside our newly created site so that's the my my, my blog in case so cd means change directory and i'm inside you make sure you are inside the site you just created so uh, to start the server, server what we do is jekyll server that means uh, we are commanding jekyll to start the server or you can just make it small to jekyll yes also okay so uh, the server has started and it has given the server address so this is the address for mm, for the website being generated locally so you can just copy it or just click here to open in the browser so okay wow this is our website so <coughs> the kill has automatically generated a basic website for us and this looks very awesome so this is our home page and this is these are the posts blog post this is the description for of our website these are the links this is the footer header and this is the next page about page and uh, let me show you post so there are code highlighting options syntax highlighting everything and it is 100% mobile responsive to it it will automatically fit to your screen size okay you can just see how it looks so this is so nice without any much effort that is automatically it generates awesome sites for us so <coughs> mm, to stop the server you can just press ctrl and c together so 
to the server as a stock okay this much for today uh, we did the basic installation process of Zekil I try it uh, hope you have done it too so in my next video I will show you how to add new pages and posts in your Zekil site so I will be back soon take care